today here on Blue Shift Ministries. We're going to call this one needy. Quite frankly, I find needy people repulsive. I don't like needy people. If you're too needy, if you need, if you're that needy person, you need bloodline cleansing for sure. You need to cleanse yourself out. You need to question the spirit and why are you so needy? Because it's not normal to be needy. I think people who are greedy will find more acceptance more than people who are needy which is wrong which is wrong if you're needy if you're greedy you're wrong but needy is just too ir irritating and it's just too annoying if you're a needy person it goes deeper were you abused as a child were you neglected as a child does something happen in your bloodline to feel that neglect are you a descent of slavery I notice people who are needy usually have a slavery situation in their bloodline. I also believe that if you are a needy person, and please share this video with as many people as you can, especially if they are needy. I have noticed people who practice witchcraft are extremely, extremely, extremely needy. Why is that? Because they become the ultimate attention whore. That ultimate attention whore not only demands attention, but it just needs too much so much it's because it's losing so much you the more they practice witchcraft the more they lose so the more they lose the more they feel they need to need the more they practice it the more they lose the more they practice it the more they even go insane because it comes to a point that remember we cannot serve two masters but yet, now that needy person wants to be served entirely. And you will notice that they want everything done for them. They want you to cook for them. You, they want you to buy things for them. They want, you want, they want you to be their chauffeur, their maid, and their butler. They become very un controlling. They become very abusive. And when their needs are not met, they make the world and life around them miserable. They have to be first in everything. No, that person needs to be cast out. Let us pray. In the name of the blood of Jesus Christ, Son of David, I bind all forms of witchcraft. I bind all forms of neediness. I bind all forms of witchcraft neediness. To all those who are practice witchcraft for watching this video, may you descend into hell alive. May you come to the kingdom and repent for your sins. And if you're that stubborn, you don't descend into hell alive because there is no need for you. There's no need for neediness and there is no need for your existence. You defy father. You practice mediums and necromancers. You defy father. You become a Jezebel. You defy father. And as we all know, Jezebel, you will be food for the dogs. To every woman and man who's a Jezebel, you will be food for the dogs. That did not grow old then. It's still quite new now. I have animals, I have dogs, and they are starving for Jezebel's flesh. Because I remember who I serve. I serve a God who never dies and always rises from the kingdom of the Most High. I will always fast, I will always repent, I will always be obedient. And yes, I will always and forever bloodline cleanse. And I will always believe in Jesus always. Amen.